went on their mission to deliver God's word about Sarah's pregnancy by Abraham. The cross reference writing in Hebrews 13 to Mark 12 21. Then verse 9 to 13. Then they said to him, Where is your Sarah, your wife? And he said, Here in the tent. And he said, I will certainly return to you according to the time of life. And behold, Sarah, your wife shall have a son. Sarah was listening in the tent door, which was behind him. Now Abraham and Sarah were old, well advanced in age. And Sarah had passed the age of a child weary. Therefore Sarah left within herself, saying, After I have grown old, shall I have a pleasure, my Lord, being also old. And the Lord said to Abraham, Why did Sarah left, saying, Shall I surely bear a child since I am old? The divine, <laughs> the divine messengers told to Abraham about Sarah's uh, son, Pregnant. Oh, 
public office like an immigrant office. She was well accustomed to living in Sodom. She had exercised his free will to choose Sodom like the garden of the Lord, while Abraham had chosen Joah like the land of Egypt. She, the question two, dwelled in Sodom, being restored over his stolen goods by Abraham. Now he began the following office for Sodom. Whenever Lot discovered Sodom, the ungodly city in the country, such as robbery, pride, the neglect of the poor, or homosexuality, he should move out of Sodom with his family members. Even if Lot might have kept the holiness from Sodom flesh, <laughs> his family members were crafty, such as his sons, not to listen to Lot in verse 14, and his daughter's incest in verse 31 up to 35. It's a lunch, whatever man sows, either to the flesh or to the spirit, that he will also reap. In fact, Lot also was a protein or a compromise with a little flesh in verse 6. Permission of his daughter to be raped by the mob. And in verse 16, his lingering was the hesitating to escape from Sodom. That all cross reference right here. Verse 2. And he said, Here now, my Lord, please turn in to your servant's house and spend the night in washing your feet, and you may rise early and go your way. And they said, No, but you will spend the night in the open square. But he uh, insisted strongly, so they returned him to him and entered uh, his house. Then he made them a feast and baked unleavened bread, and they ate. Unlike the public in Sodom, Lot provided lodging, washing feet, a feast, the unleavened bread, stated the first time, uh, first in the scripture, and the leaven is a type of sin, and so it is sinless or pure bread. Even in a hospitality country at that time, like Abraham's last doing, uh, last uh, hospitality, Lot also practiced God's uh, second greatest command to love your neighbor and yourself. Matthew 16, 11, here, there is, uh, uh, Easter is a standard for uh, is a sin. A symbol of sin. 4 to 8. Now, before they lay down the man of the city, the man of Sodom, both old and young, all the people from every quarter surrounded the house, and they called to the Lord and said to him, We are the man who came to you tonight. Bring them out to us, that you may know them carnally. So the Lord went out to them through the doorway, and shut the door behind him. And said, Please, my brethren, do not do so wickedly. See, now I have two daughters who have not known a man. Please let me bring them out to you, and you may do to them as you wish. Only do nothing to these men, since this is the reason they have come under the shadow of my roof. The old and young man of Sodom forced to commit homosexuality, carnality, and wickedly, with the divine messengers. It is uh, observed that the homosexuality was a common practice in Sodom, like today. Lot suggested her two daughters to be raped by them, so the divine messengers. <laughs> For the sake of the divine uh, messengers, he a lot of serious impurity is shown over even his deep hospitality to the divine messengers. Philippians chapter 4, 8, uh, right here. Finally, brethren, whatever uh, things are true, whatever 
Sodom and Gomorrah as an archaeologist discovered some devils. The people there have become so corrupt that they wouldn't do any good. This confirmed the righteous man like Abraham who lived by faith fervent to prayer avails uh, much. <laughs> Jews. Also, Ruth, as a mob woman, 
Thank you. 